Throughout history our planet has been through multiple ice ages and fully covered in ice at least twice from the poles to the equator. The Earth was a giant snowball at least several times. Today the landscape has transformed the ice is starting to rapidly melt and scientists are wondering what secrets could be concealed beneath this frozen tundra. This is the second largest ice sheet on Earth. It has an impressive thickness of nearly 2 miles covering. 80% of the area of Greenland here rapid glaciers. Like Jakob Chauvin move at an astonishing 150 feet per day, reshaping the landscape while coastal waters create icebergs towering 300 feet about the height of the Statue of Liberty. But these things are not what makes the island unique to this day the frozen surface hides all kinds of secrets. But scientists have already started uncovering some of them. And what they found was difficult to predict. Although Greenland is over three times the size of Texas, its total population is just 56,000 people. The world's lowest population density, the majority of the island is uninhabitable due to its frigid temperatures, but the southwest coast of Greenland, where the Gulf Stream's warming effect produces moderate temperatures and a comfortable habitat, is home to the third of the world's population. The Greenland ice sheet receives fresh snowfall which is initially light and fluffy with a density of around 50 to 70 kilograms per cubic meter as it accumulates new layers. Because temperatures are always below zero, the snow never melts. There are 695,000 cubic meters of glacial ice in Greenland, which is thought to have existed for hundreds of thousands to millions of years. However, Greenland wasn't always frozen. Beneath its icy cover lies a massive rocky island that was once a flourishing haven, where life thrived amidst valleys, rivers, and numerous lakes. Even today, not all of Greenland is covered in ice. Moving to the southernmost reaches of the island is the Singwa Valley, the only forested area. As temperatures rise, it is possible that this green patch of land will cause vegetation to spread. When U.S. military scientists bore through over a mile of ice in northwestern Greenland in 1966, they discovered fossilized plants with unusually well-preserved foliage and evidence of a once-green past. Scientists characterized them as freeze-dried. A time capsule that lets us peek into Greenland's ancient ecosystems is present in parts of the country that had spring-roll forests and tundra, which is a flat, windy, cold region devoid of trees, but home to resilient low-lying plants today. If you pour water on them, they will unfold and appear almost as though they were frozen just yesterday, some 400,000 years ago. Because of Greenland's huge ice sheets, which function as an insulator, the ground underneath is kept warm by the Earth's internal heat while being protected from the bitterly cold temperatures and winds above. From below, in some areas, the ice sheet is firmly attached to the frozen ground, which provides stability. However, closer to the ice sheet's edges, where it is thinner, the base is thawed and the ice is covering moist soil. If there is enough water beneath it, the ice can flow more quickly, which could accelerate the melting rate. Currently, the ice sheet in Greenland melts away at a rate of over 200 billion tons annually, which is equivalent to filling nearly 91 million Olympic swimming pools each holding 60, 4, and 30 gallons of water. If it melts completely, the global sea level will rise approximately 23 feet, causing catastrophic damage to millions of people who live along the world's coasts. A 2019 study found that 680 million people live in low-lying coastal areas. Although it will likely take a while for all of the ice to melt, Greenland loses more ice than it gains. The immense size of the Devon Sheet is difficult to comprehend. Its weight has created such pressure that it caused a depression 1,000 feet below sea level in the island center. A similar event occurred approximately 20,000 years ago when parts of Earth were pushed deeper into the crust by a massive mass of Earth. There used to be ice sheets all over the world. The Arctic, Scandinavia, and a large portion of the United States and Canada were covered in ice. However, something interesting is happening in these areas right now. Imagine the surface of our planet as a massive shaped memory mattress. When pressure is applied, it will compress, 
But when the pressure is released, it will slowly begin to return to its original form. This is similar to how ice sheets shrink the land beneath them, rises while other areas descend to compensate. This process is extremely sluggish, and some places are still recovering. While some regions of the Earth, like the United States East Coast, will continue to sink for thousands of years, other regions, like these, are much more vulnerable to rising sea levels. Today, Greenland is anything but green, but scientists have already been able to peer beneath its ice cover, revealing what the islands have been hiding for centuries. In 2013, a new canyon was discovered, surpassing the Grand Canyon in Arizona in length by more than 1.5 times. Greenland once had a massive lake that covered an area as large as Rhode Island and Delaware combined. It drew water from at least 18 streams, reaching depths of 800 feet today. The ancient lake is a depression filled with sediment, holding secrets of a time when it was water instead of ice that shaped Greenland's landscape. Although you can't see it just yet, the subglacial canyon is the longest canyon ever found on Earth. It is buried beneath billions of tons of ice. A network of mountain ranges thousands of meters above sea level was discovered by decades of ice-penetrating radar surveys. The mountain ranges' sharp ridges and deep valleys influence the movement of the massive ice sheet above, which takes on the shape of the hidden, mountainous terrain. Additionally, there are submerged FS deep channels carved by glacial forces that extend hundreds to thousands of meters below the surface. The subglacial mountains in Greenland act as obstacles, guiding the flow of melting ice and changing its direction. FS are similar to the paths that icebergs take to escape into the ocean. The island's icy veil conceals not only a mysterious past but also a wealth of natural resources. Greenland's glaciers are always moving. Geological investigations indicate that elements such as neodymium, dysprosium, and europium, which are present in Greenland's bedrock and are rare earth and valuable metals, are essential for the creation of contemporary electronics. Technologies for renewable energy and many high-tech uses in addition to potentially harboring valuable metals like gold, silver, and platinum. The subglacial landscape of the island has a lot of water that is trapped in the enormous Antarctic and Greenland ice sheets, which together contain more than 68% of the freshwater on Earth. Provide due to its distinct geological characteristics, Greenland has enormous potential for the development of geothermal energy, a sustainable substitute for conventional energy sources. The concept is to capture heat that escapes from the Earth's interior and rises to the surface. This process is called heat flow, and the west coast of Greenland exhibits heat flow that is three times greater than the island's average. In contrast to fossil fuels, geothermal power generation emits very little greenhouse gases. Greenland is a treasure because it could someday be humanity's passport to a carbon-free existence treasure trove of priceless materials, but it's also a location where Mother Nature displays her artistic side. Imagine how vast the space between the island's icy cover and its bedrock should be to fit something this massive. In 2010, scientists discovered strange formations beneath the Greenland ice sheet. At first, they thought these might be ghost mountains like those found in Antarctica, but as it turned out later, they were mistaken. These formations are known as jelly roll sculptures, and there are dozens of them in Greenland. The gigantic features are made of an unusual ice. Rather than being composed of layers, it is twisted or rolled, and according to radar, it can be as old as 120,000 years. Imaging researchers discovered that jelly roll sculptures can be found just below Greenland's white landscape. The island was long considered like a layered cake, but one that's made of snow. Although as you go deeper, peeling off layer after layer, at some point they are no longer flat. The ice down there looks more like it's been bent or folded several times. There's a lot of science behind how that happens, but in simple terms, ice grows from the bottom up when the ice sheet melts and refreezes. It's somewhat like building a sandcastle. The wet sand duper solidifies at the base, adding substance to the lower layers. Similarly, the refrozen ice adds to the layers, creating a complex folded structure beneath the seemingly flat surface that's been forming for hundreds, 
or even thousands of years. But deep below the mighty EY sheet, there's something much older. Back when Greenland was still a temperate rainforest, the island was struck by an asteroid 0.9 m across. The impact was probably millions of times more powerful than an atomic bomb, enough to cause earthquakes of magnitude 9 and massive wildfires. Fortunately, it all occurred long before the first humans and after the dinosaurs had already gone extinct. The asteroid left the location of the 19-meter-wide Hawaii crater, which is currently beneath 3,000 feet of ice and was discovered in 2018, was crucial because the crater is beneath the northwestern edge of the Antarctic sheet. The sediments found in the stream that flows beneath the sheet suggest that the area was once subjected to rapid and extreme heating, as evidenced by the sand grains found there. Researchers discover the astounding 58 million years ago, music, as the exact time the collision occurred. One of the planet's most remarkable landscapes is Greenland. We've only just begun to explore this barren landscape, but in the years to come, innumerable studies will be carried out, and who knows what additional secrets could be asleep under the massive stretch of ice waiting to be revealed. AP is protecting the mysteries of our planet's history. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more exciting discoveries about the fascinating world we live in. What secrets might the almost alien expanse of land hide? Clues to our planet's future extraordinary species of animals or even a long-lost civilization? Let us know in the comments section below.